oh God, I do protect God, let's protect us right now. We need you, Lord. We need you, Lord. We need your protection, Lord. Come the storm, Lord. Come the storm, Lord. Oh God, thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your blessing. Thank you for your protection. Thank you, oh God, for what you've done. Thank you for what you're going to do. God, you're God all by yourself. Oh, how mercy upon us, Lord. It was a very um, tragic time, very difficult time, very fearful time in of our very own lives that was not easy at all what we had to go through and as a father as a husband you can imagine how difficult it was for for me to see uh, my family uh, fearful and having to protect them and uh, at the point of uh, hopelessness not knowing what to do because of the devastation um, of the storm my faith in god kept kept me and kept my family uh together because um again you know it was very difficult for us, and I mean for many others, I, I've heard many stories about others praying and trusting the Lord uh, through that de uh, devastating time. Uh, you, what you saw on the video and with us um, praying. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. That was the second part of the storm. The first part had already occurred and we had already gone through the eye and then that, you know, the, the second part, you know, wind shift and it was, I mean, uh, ferocious when it came around again. And so we, uh, we, we couldn't go outside, we couldn't run nowhere, and the uh, roof was buckling. That, I mean, that was not really a hurricane. That, that was a monster. But we eventually got out uh, from Marshall Airport seven days, uh, six days after the storm. Thank God for that, but it, it was chaos out there. Uh, remember, uh, after leaving our home, we slept in a shelter for a few days. Uh, by Friendship Tabernacle Church, and eventually we came, we came out on the, on the charter, landed at the Odyssey Private Airport here in Nassau, and I mean, uh, we were so elated, lose some fa family relatives, some cousins, you know, that uh, bodies have not been found, uh, and um, um, we've heard stories about, you know, their, their tragedy during the storm. I am not sure whether we're going to uh, find, find the, the, them. Hopefully we can recover some bodies and give the, give the families uh, you know, a decent burial. And I've seen, one of the things I've seen, coming here to Nassau, we came here with no idea of what we were going to do. You know, we were thinking about where we're going to go overseas and what have you. And the Lord opened doors for us here. It was, it was a challenge for us, but when we came here, I, I got, you know, we were staying at the Malia Hotel for about four weeks. And it was a relief to take a shower. Uh, but we, you know, the, the thing is, we came, as Williams, we came with our only five backpacks. Only five backpacks. We didn't, couldn't bring no bags, bring nothing. You know, we, we just, because, you know, everybody's rushing to get in the plane. You can't overweight, you know, plane can't be overweight. And so, you know, we just had to come, what we could carry. I, I just came with a bag full of documents because, you know, those are very important. I mean, God has been working, moving, you know, and things have been coming together. Uh, the house that we're in now, the Lord bless us with it. You know, I haven't worked since I've been here. My wife is not working. We're trying to establish a business. You know, I'm still waiting on a, uh, a, a job that the government said they want me to do, but I'm still waiting, you know, and uh, I've done all my part and I, I'm just leaving it in the hands of the Lord. But uh, my son had just started working recently, but the Lord is blessing us. Uh, the bills are being paid. The God be the glory for that, you know. And, you know, we talk about clothes. We didn't have no clothes on our back. We got a closet full of clothes. You know, so God is restoring. Now I am I'm praying the Lord and trusting the Lord for a car. That's the only I'm, that's what I'm believing God for right now. So you know, but but God is providing. It was difficult coming in. It was difficult for many of our people who came to Nassau. You know, uh, who, were, who were devastated, didn't know anything about social services, all this the 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 different uh, NGOs and different groups that were offering supplies. Thank God for them. We, we do plan to go back home. Like I said earlier, I think the government want me to do something there uh, that we have uh, worked on and I've, I've done all my part and I'm just waiting to hear from them. Uh, I'm eager to do that. I believe I can make a difference. I believe I bring something to the table. And so I want to con contribute something back to uh, my country as I've been doing before in the past.